Maryland Representative Jamie Raskin went off on Marjorie Taylor Greene for spouting Russian talking points during a debate on President Biden's request for an additional $33 billion to arm Ukraine in their fight against the illegal invasion of Putin's Russian forces. We are here to debate aid to the people of Ukraine defending themselves against a massive invasion by Vladimir Putin and his army. Then the minority puts up the distinguished general lady from Georgia who does not mention Ukraine once. She does not mention the thousands of Ukrainian civilians who've been slaughtered by Putin's army. She does not mention more than 100 Ukrainian children who've been shot and killed by the Ukrainian army. Instead, she talks about a massive invasion at the border, a massive invasion which their own speakers have said today hundreds of thousands of people have been apprehended in. That's very different from a military invasion. The one in Ukraine, of course, the general lady is not going to talk about that. She had a lot to say the other day when she heckled me continuously. When I came to the floor, it was like the Rocky Horror Picture Show in here with her chanting about the Russia hoax and Russia this and Russia that. Now she had the opportunity to tell the world what her views about Russia are. I put them out there, exactly what she has said. She said that the aid that the taxpayers of America are sending to the people of Ukraine to defend themselves against Vladimir Putin and the Russian army falls into the hands of Nazis. I want to see her proof. Where's her evidence? She talks about NATO Nazis. Does my minority believe that our allies in NATO who are trying to defend the people of Ukraine are Nazis? Has it come to this? General Lady talked about a massive invasion. We had a massive invasion of our own chamber. And she continued to be a cheerleader for the insurrection and deny what happened here. Mr. Speaker, I'd like those words to be taken down. At the end there, that was a Republican calling to take down Jamie Raskin's remarks and not that of their own Marjorie Taylor Greene, which is really interesting because this week, Republicans have been celebrating the Elon Musk takeover of Twitter as a major win for free speech. But as soon as someone criticizes one of their own for spreading Russian propaganda on the floor of Congress, they demand censorship. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, like it and share it to help it spread. I'm Brendan Plank. I'll see you in the next one.